What's up, y'all? This is Chad with Outsiders Mud Crew, OMC Off Road. Introducing our uh, Maverick X3 gasket and also Defender 2018 and newer. This is the box and stock configuration, the stock duck bill, and we've got like four PSI on it right now. And even with no PSI on it, you can see it leaks right here around the airbox lid, also leaking out of the duck bill, obviously. Um, other than that, it's just pouring out all around the lid. We're gonna show you our gasket, how it goes on, and also a uh, simple solution for your duck bill. I'm gonna walk you through how to change it. Take your three clamps off. This one didn't have a gasket in it. I don't know if yours will. You can already see on this one where it's got some water and uh, mud and stuff that's already got in there and inside of here. I have a used gasket that we had in there and then I have a, a new one. Um, one of the cool things about our gaskets is they, they recoup their shape very quickly. I was gonna show you where it cinches down on here on a certain spot it's gonna be tighter. And because of the way it's designed, it'll be tighter in one spot than in, than in the other. But it's already returned to form. So, first thing, uh, you look at your lid, you're gonna have a little triangle piece that's inside of there. And it's just a little tab. Uh, it's just kind of it's on there to kind of line up the lid when you set it on so you don't You know, you can cut it off But it just makes it a little easier when you're installing it and you you know the way these boxes are designed They, they want the, the duct bill down. It's not gonna really matter after we make it airtight because we're gonna put a, a cap on it But uh, anyway, so I'm gonna pull the duct bill off. I think there may be a clamp on the uh, Alright, So you take the gasket it's easiest to start on the on the tight spot first, and you just put a little pressure and squeeze, not too much, or you, you, you will rip the gasket, but just a little pressure, and you can even use a little flathead or something. I don't have one, but, and it'll, it'll sit down in there like that. And then, the rest is pretty common sense. You just run it around. There's gonna be another firm spot, uh, just to help it set in there better. And then boom. Just make sure all your clamps are free and then. Once you line that triangle up, it'll sit on there, you know, almost flush right there. So the compression's perfect. You just grab it and. So we got the cap on. We're probably gonna sell those on the website too. Make it easy for you, get it all right there. Uh, of course, we're gonna have the airbox seal. We already sell the CVT seal for the Defender and the X3 and the Maverick Trail. And we don't know, I think this may be similar to the box on the Maverick Trail, but we don't know yet. So uh, we should know in about a week and we'll be able to uh, to address that. Maybe we'll make another video, I don't know. So, okay. Um, we've got about four PSI on it when we hold it and it's leaking out right here in the same spot it does on the on the first defender boxes so everything else is sealed it's not leaking down here it's not leaking around the air box it's kind of hard to tell because it's all drifting that way but um, you can just see that it's sealed it's actually got we'll turn it up too much smoke now but anyway so you can see it's sealed down here now it's sealed on on the airbox lid surface it's trying to all back out through the through the back side of this and the uh, loose control solenoid but uh, right here we've got to push up against here and we can see it's leaking and you can feel it around your deal it may not leak in vacuum um, these boxes are never going to see positive pressure unless there's a backfire or something, but uh, it may not leak in vacuum ever. But uh, it's a simple fix. You just put a bead of silicone around here, clean the surface with some alcohol, brake clean, whatever, sand it up a little, and uh, put you a nice bead of silicone around there. And you don't have to worry about it. We're, we're against silicone, but 
there's really no other uh, way to fix this easily. Thanks for watching the video. Hit like, hit subscribe, or follow us on Facebook, Instagram.